At Monterey Bay Aquarium, our mission extends beyond our exhibits. Since 2017, we've been carbon neutral, and today we're on an ambitious journey toward becoming net zero in both emissions and waste by 2035. But what does that really mean, and why does it matter for our ocean? Think of your carbon footprint like running a bath with the drain open. You're using a lot of water, but the water level stays the same because it's draining at the same rate. In other words, we're still releasing carbon, but we're balancing it through offsets, like wetland restoration. Since 2017, we've been carbon neutral, and here's how. After we calculate our emissions, reduce them where possible through energy efficiency and renewable power, we then offset the remaining emissions by supporting environmental projects. Now imagine switching from a bath to a low flow shower that uses 90% less water. Instead of constantly filling and draining a full tub, we're using dramatically less water in the first place. To reach net zero emissions, we aim to cut them by 90% based on what they were in 2017 and then offset the remaining 10%. Instead of stopping at carbon neutral, we're making much more fundamental changes to our operations by reducing our emissions as much as possible, then removing an equal amount of any remaining necessary emissions through projects like tree planting and wetland restoration. Despite the U.S. having withdrawn from the Paris Agreement in the past, the Monterey Bay Aquarium is all in on climate change. Climate action can't wait, so we've aligned our sustainability goals with the agreement's targets regardless of national politics. Our science-based approach reflects our beliefs that institutions like ours must lead by example. In 2018, we became the first business in the Monterey Bay region powered by 100% wind and solar energy. We've eliminated single-use plastics from our gift shop and food services, replacing them with sustainable alternatives and our closed loop recycling partnerships ensure materials like nitrile gloves and shipping materials are reused rather than landfilled. We've also revolutionized our waste management using innovative systems like food recyclers that reduce food waste volume by 80% and transform it into nutrient rich grounds for gardens and animal feed. Behind the scenes, we've digitized our operations to reduce paper use, implemented comprehensive recycling programs, and even aligned our endowment investments with our environmental mission by eliminating direct investments in fossil fuel companies. Our sustainability efforts extend across our entire campus. That includes 15 buildings spanning three zip codes. Each facility is working toward the same net zero goals, creating a comprehensive approach to environmental sustainability. We've also partnered with 30 other aquariums and zoos through the Aquarium Conservation Partnership, amplifying our collective impact and sharing best practices. You can join us on this journey, subscribe to our Ocean Action Newsletter, or follow us on social media for the latest sustainability tips. Small actions add up to meaningful change, whether it's bringing a reusable water bottle when you visit us, choosing sustainable transportation options, or making eco-friendly choices at home. Together, we can create a healthier ocean and planet. At Monterey Bay Aquarium, we're proving that environmental leadership is possible. Join us as we work together toward a sustainable future for our ocean and our world.